Uh, we went to the place to shoot it, which was massively helpful. Uh, we couldn't have done it, I don't think, in Brussels, you know, for Italy. It just wouldn't have worked, you know. Uh, we raced cars, which was uh, helpful. Uh, it was very much Michael's way into the character, was someone who was uh, calm on the surface but had a constant engine going. We met Piero Ferrari, who was very open with uh, his father's life, uh, literally opening the doors to... Uh, his apartment, Enzo's apartment, his briefcase, you know, everything about him. And we went to the factory, it was it was extensive and long. You know, you read the book, we, we shot in the locations where the things actually happened. Uh, it's all kind of helpful. And the script, of course, was was, uh, was great. Yeah, sure. And um, how was adapting your language as well to, you know, a kind of more Italian way of speaking? Well, Michael wanted subtle uh, dialects, the idea that they were speaking to each other in their own language so they're not making mistakes, you know, so it's not like a stereotypical Italian accent. And in Italy, everyone obviously has a different dialect based on their region, so it was also about finding like a Modenese uh, uh, attitude. I noticed that. And did you manage to drive any cars of them? Yeah, we raced some Ferraris in Modena. Uh, and we, we drove the chassis for one of the 801s, I think, that was in the movie. And it, there's a difference between one that where you roll over, you'll take your head off, and the other one where you at least are protected by, you know, a cage, you know. So there, you became very, almost how heroic these guys were to kind of pursue an ideal over their own personal safety.